Hi, I'm Richard, and over the last 10 years, I have helped students get into Bayes' MBA program with a 98% success rate. That is over three times the 30% average acceptance rate. And today, for the first time, I'm going to share some of the tips and tricks I give my premium students to give you the edge in your application. Now, MBA has the standard requirement of a 2-1, that's a 3.3 GPA requirement or international equivalent. But Bayes are known for being very flexible on this. They also have a three-year work experience minimum, which is a couple of years less than the average five years work experience for most other MBA programs. Now, importantly, both the 2-1 requirement and the three years work experience can be looked over for exceptional candidates. If you have a 2-2, a lower qualification or no university degree, but you have six years of work experience, you can still apply for this course. You can also have a GMAT waiver that's increasingly attractive for our students. But if you don't manage to get that waiver, then the average requirement is just five, five, five. It's a fairly low GMAT bar compared to other business schools. Now, because of these slightly lower entrance requirements, but Bayes is still ranked number five in the UK and often in the top 10 or top 20 across Europe, this is a fantastic option for all candidates to apply to. Either for a top candidate, it can help them to stand out if they get an early off to Bayes and use that as leverage or a negotiating chip when trying to get a scholarship for another business school, or indeed it is probably the best of the rest for those who think they might not get into a top school such as Oxbridge or LBS. Now, my number one tip for this program is to show rapid career progression. Bayes are looking not just for people who are good now, but people who are going to be brilliant. How do you show that trajectory in your application? Well, you want to write about it in the career planning questions. Bayes doesn't have a personal statement, so you can't copy and paste or spam applications to this school. Instead, they have four questions about your motivation and three of them about your career and research. In that motivation, that first and most important question, you want to talk about how quickly you've been promoted. If not explicitly promoted to a new role, then what have you been given as additional responsibility? Which people have you been asked to manage? Which projects and responsibilities have you been given? Even if it's just managing the stationary cupboard, talk about how you did it faster and better than anybody else. Now, many candidates will have five or 10 years of work experience. So this is a course also open to those with additional experience, but even more important to show every few years what were the promotions that you've achieved. You also need to talk to your referee and get them talking about how you're brilliant and making it very clear in your CV how you would quickly move between jobs where you headhunted if not promoted. Now, tip number two for Bayes' MBA is clear research on your career. Three of those questions will be where do you see yourself in five years? and what ideal job are you looking for? And what is the research you've done as to whether they take MBAs and do you have an alternative plan if you haven't? So Bayes really want to know that you are going to get a job after this. Rather than just saying something vague, like I want to work in finance or a generic company, like I want to work at the best, such as Goldman Sachs, instead find an interesting boutique firm. The more specific you are on the desk, the department, the area, what projects that company's recently worked on, who you're gonna manage, the more of that you put in, the better chance you have of showing that you are a research candidate who's going to get an offer straight after the MBA. They really care about their recruitment statistics, so make sure that you are putting in your research. Treat this more like a job application than an MBA application, I often tell my candidates. Now, that's just two of over 12 tips that we have that can help our students to increase their chances. If you're looking for more help, then please do look at the end of the video or in the description below on how you can work with someone like myself or one of my amazing team. We've also got a free exemplar statement. This will tell you how to write an excellent application and talk about the five pillars that you may have seen me talk about in other videos. Download it now, give yourself the edge in your application. Tip number three, and this is especially important for Bayes, is to attend an open day or a coffee or virtual coffee event. 
Now, Bayes understand that they've got to compete very hard to persuade people to join them over other business schools. And because of that, if you go to an open day and ask the right questions and meet the right people, they will strongly encourage you to apply, meaning they've met you and they're going to give you an advantage in the application. We've even had candidates receive offers on the spot before they submitted their application. How did they achieve this? They researched and completed their written application before they went to the event. So when others were asking very basic questions, the sort of information that anyone could find online, our candidates were going in and asking very good detailed questions about the individual courses, models and lecturers and career opportunities. By doing so, they impressed how well researched they were. They convinced Bayes that they were going to get a very good job after Bayes. And so Bayes was really interested in making them an offer. And in some cases, even encouraged them to apply for scholarships. So use these open days, but don't go in green. Research, know your stuff and treat it like an interview. Remember, you only have one shot to make the first impression with these business schools. So make it a good one. Now, my final tip is interview preparation. The interview is very important in Bayes. They have quite a low bar for the interview, but the interview is carrying more weight than any other business school in the UK. So how will we prepare for this? Well, have three or four buzz quotes, the most impressive things about yourself. Maybe it's a rapid promotion, maybe it's an amazing achievement at work, maybe it's a really high grade or the rank top of a course module. Whatever they are, have those ready and just keep repeating those same points to make sure that you're remembered for those. Obviously turn up on time and early if you can, look very, very presentable. And I strongly recommend finding out who you're going to meet researching their LinkedIn and finding some commonality so you can open the interview by making some small talk about what they've achieved and what you can learn from them. Now, that's just a small number of tips on how to get into Bayes' MBA program. If you would like to 3x your chances by working with a professional admissions consultant such as myself or one of the amazing ex-admissions officers throughout our network, we'd love to work with you using the information on screen now. Lastly, if you found this helpful, please do like and subscribe. And if you've got any budding questions, please put it in the comment below. I get back to as many comments as I possibly can to help as many people as we can. Most importantly, good luck.